Now to the homeless crisis. L.A. Mayor Karen Bass has vowed to help get people off the street and indoors. Yeah, now her Inside Safe program is focusing its efforts on an encampment near the Beverly Center. KCAL's Jeff Nguyen takes a closer look tonight at the spot on San Vicente Boulevard and spoke with neighbors about the progress there. The LAPD returned to San Vicente Boulevard near the Beverly Center one day after Mayor Karen Bass and Councilwoman Katie Yaroslavsky announced an inside safe operation where neighbors have complained about a series of encampments. <laughs> Two weeks ago, this is what it looked like outside the business belonging to Mima Adams. She and her neighbors say things are much better. It was just like an overwhelming feeling this morning when I was able just to opened his door without feeling afraid. I think it's amazing. Um, I have to give real credit to Karen Bass for prioritizing the area and helping people get off the streets and um, into some temporary shelter and housing. Marie Carpenter teared up as she spoke to reporters about moving off the streets. I feel overwhelmed. I feel overwhelmed. I'm happy that somebody's going to help me. I've, being out here for two years and after two years I just lost my baby this last year when I've been out here it's just hard. The mayor's office says the unhoused are being moved into hotels with the purpose of getting them into permanent housing. Michael oh, Bowman God, says he was confused God. about why LAPD showed up. Excuse me I have to get this packed up because if I don't I'm gonna go to jail. The mayor's office says the officers were not part of Inside Safe, which is a layered process that may take several days before people are willing to accept services. Workers are also connecting the unhoused with Medi-Cal and food support. Thursday afternoon, sanitation workers cleared out unwanted belongings and power washed this median. Mima Adams says she's appreciative of City Hall. However, I want to say that I want to feel excited. It's like a night and day. I just hope and pray that it's going to continue to stay this way. I have my doubts. The mayor's office says more than 20 people were brought inside on Wednesday and eight more on Thursday. Reporting in Beverly Wood, Jeff Nguyen, KCOW News.